What's up guys, welcome back to my channel y'all. So I'm gonna just pull some cards and get a message out for y'all. I definitely do hope the messages resonate and I definitely do hope the messages are useful. Um, I'm gonna shuffle the deck a good two more times for y'all and then we're just gonna get started. I definitely do hope everybody is happy, healthy, and safe. And with that being said, we're just gonna jump right into it, okay? Right off the bat, you got the death card coming out. You have the Will of Fortune. You also have the Six of Wands. You also have the Five of Wands coming out. You got the Emperor card coming out along with the just the um, Judgment. Excuse me. You also have the sun. Yeah, something was like illuminated to someone. Some sort of upgrade, some sort of um, empowerment. Yeah, you got the high priestess coming out along with the, the seven of wands. You got Pisces energy out here. Heavy Leo with the six of wands and the sun. You got Aries as well, Scorpio with his death. Yeah, with the hangman, this is about your transformation. People think that you were stuck, you were stagnant in a certain situation, they were blocking you. Like it was a thing where you had people thinking that they were like blocking you. What's this judgment? Or like that they were affecting you in some sort of way? Yeah, with the Queen of Wands, could be a fire sign. A Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Or if not, it's something about your beauty, your attractiveness with the tower. Yeah, and the temperance, heavy Sagittarius energy as well. You're almost like, um, it, mm, it's almost like, not vibrating, but like your your aura is like polarizing right now. You're, you're glowing in a sense. What's this death? Yeah, you got the king of wands. Heavy fire sign. Yeah, heavy on the attraction. It's something to do with like how good you're looking right now. Yeah, with the knight of pentacles, you definitely could have like glowed up. Like these are people seeing like it may have took time for you to glow up. Like, you know, you went through, you went through your stages, but people feel like you're on top right now. Yeah, with the ten of cups. What's this King of Wands with the death? You got the Knight of Cups. Yeah, and someone feels like now you are like completely out of their league with the Three of Swords. Someone feels like, especially at one point in time, you were like, you didn't beg for love, but like you kind of, you bent for certain people or you let certain things like slide. Um, you lowered your boundaries for certain individuals. Um, I didn't get the seven of cups, but I do feel like this, this could be a specific person, but does someone does feel like, especially now that something's like ended, you, you've grown up, you look better. Their chances with you, yeah, to be with you is like very slim to none now. What's this will of fortune? Yeah, you got the four of swords. With the will of fortune. Hmm. You got someone thinking about like, who you're going to end up with, who you're going to end up like being with. Yeah, with the Queen of Pentacles. I'm not going to take it. What's this Will of Fortune with the Four of Swords? Yeah, you got the Fool and the Moon. This is somebody who like secretly thinks about like the opportunities that you're going to go towards. The opportunities is going to come like towards you as well. Like the all the new leaps of faith that you're going to like take. Cause this, this could be someone who thought like, they were holding you back at one point in time or they that they did at one point in time as well. But this is somebody who's seen like you've undergone some sort of transformation, some sort of change, some sort of glow up. Especially if you used to doubt yourself or this person was able to make you doubt yourself in some way, shape or form. They feel like they, this, whoever this is, they feel like they have no, no power over you or no power over you anymore. You got Cancer Pisces energy and the Queen of Pentacles still at the bottom of the deck. You got Capricorn Taurus Virgo as well. Yeah, with the Ten of Wands, whoever this person is, they're definitely, um, Stressed, but that's to say the least. What's the Emperor card? You got Aries energy out here. Yeah, you got the seven. This is somebody who just wanted control with the Magician. You got the Seven of Cups coming out to clarify the um, Emperor card. I was gonna say the Aries card, but of course it could be an Aries. Doesn't have to be. This person could even be a father. Um, but yeah, this could even be someone who was trying to tell you how to like parent as well at one point in time, but only take that it resonates. Um, 
but yeah, this was somebody who wanted you to be in some sort of like illusion, some sort of, but it was, it's far, it was like how you seen yourself. Like this person wanted to create like how you pictured yourself, how other people viewed you as well. Like they wanted to lower your self-esteem so that way when you go out into the real world, how they felt, how, what they project on you is also how, what you show other people. Like it's crazy. So that people will kind of just think that is how you just are. This is who you just are. And it's really not. What's this judgment with the Queen of Wands? And someone is seeing that something isn't working anymore. Or that something really never was. Like, it could have been a thing that you really... I don't know. Mm. Whoever this is, they feel like you got a big, like, heart. You got the Hermit card coming out as well. You got Virgo energy out here. What's this judgment, Queen of Wands, with the Hermit? You got the King of Cups coming out. You got the Eight of Cups and you had the Five of... Mm, the Five of Swords. Yeah, this is somebody who has to walk away from, like, emotion like, manipulating you or a situation. Like, they have to walk away from it. And this person can't even lie, like, how they feel about you anymore. Like, this is... Mm. You got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy out here. This is somebody who wanted you to feel... Like, their opinion of you mattered. Like, it's, it's something about, like, you're supposed to listen. Yeah, with the lovers, you got Gemini energy out here. It's something about the, with this person talking to you, speaking to you. It's like they get offended if you, like, don't take their opinions into account. Like, they don't, like, you don't trust what they say. Like, this person wants to be able to tell you who and what you are and for you to believe them over yourself. Like, they, mm, this is somebody who, like, really didn't want you to, like, know yourself or they was hoping that you didn't yeah with the page because this person doesn't know them this person is very immature again could be a cancer price you scorpio what's this king of cups or a virgo heavy cancer though heavy pisces yeah with the knight of swords like this is somebody who mm. what's this six of wands What's the six of one? We got the page of pentacles. If I got one more. What's the six of ones? You have the queen of swords. Yeah, you have a lot of jealous like energies. I don't know if this is like a friend group, a peer group that kind of like sees you. Like this is given like irritated at your light. Like I wouldn't be surprised if this is like a person you dated and like their friends who are like jealous. And if not dead, again, this is just people who are like irritated of your life. These are peers, people you see on a day-to-day -day basis that know you. It's something about your attractiveness as well. Literally, with the King of Swords, you got the Queen of Swords that came out. So these are people like you once were really, really close to, possibly even married to, even now like divorced, or if it wasn't like married, it was a serious commitment. Or if not, these were kin to you. These are people at one point in time that were like-minded as well. Especially if you did take some sort of spiritual path or even like some sort of religious path. Like these people look at you as like different. Yeah, especially with the King of Pentacles. You got the Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Like these people, I can't even really put my, 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 mm. like I can't even wrap my mind over like how these people like really think. But it's very small. Like whatever sort, like these people thought something that they were doing to you was going to be successful. What's this page of Pentacles? Yeah, with the three of Pentacles. These people were working like in a group. This Queen of Swords, and it doesn't have to be a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. But whoever this person is, they thought they were just smarter than you. You got heavy Cancer, Pisces energy. Heavy Cancer, Pisces, but you do also have Air Sign, Virgo as well, Leo. And they, it could have been up to three people. Like these people thought that they like, since it was so many of them, you were going to like bow down to them or you're going to bend to your will. With the charity, a cancer be even be involved. Like these people wanted to like run you away out of something. I don't know. Mm. What's the sign? But you clearly moved away from this as well with the chariot that was at the bottom of the deck. You got the nine of cups coming out, you have the two of cups, and you also have the higher thing. Yeah, these are people who like I don't Something was exposed about some sort of friendship, relationship even. You got Taurus energy out here. Yeah, with the Eight of Pentacles. Or this could have even been a thing where a group of people were only like friends or associating with each other because of the dislike or disdain for you. 
as well. These people didn't like how well you were being seen by people outside of just like all of y'all. Like, I don't know, y'all. Yeah, with the two of wands. Like these are these are people who feel like you are very liked by like a lot of people and they didn't like it. Like your light really irritates whoever this group of people are. Because I definitely do feel like it's a group of people with the three of cups. <laughs> At least a group of three or more, two or more, because you got 22 as well. It could be four, but it's, it's, it is giving like up to three, three or more. What's this um, five of one? Yeah, you got the two, the two of pentacles with the eight of swords. Do people wanted you to like miss out on opportunities, not know like which way to go? Not um, with the two of pentacles, eight of swords. They wanted you to be stuck in some sort of confusion. They wanted you to be juggling everything: your finances, your thoughts, your way of living, like just your morals, like everything. These people wanted you to be stuck in a very low vibration, especially with the two of pentacles, eight of swords. Like really confused. Like these people wanted you to like doubt yourself, question yourself, question what other people were telling you. Give, <laughs> excuse me, giving to you as well. Like information with the seven, with the eight of swords. Excuse me, and this two of pentacles. These people didn't want you to, especially. I don't know. They didn't want you to know like where something was coming from. With who was saying what? Like these people, they were all really working together as like in a cahoots. Again, only if that's like resonating. And these people all lie for each other. It's a big game, but it's all, it's just, they wanted to affect their self esteem with the Four of Wands. Wow, and the Four of Cups. These people wanted you to be rejected for some sort of relationship opportunity. They wanted to get in your way. They wanted you to be seen in a way that's really not even like you. These people really wanted to provoke you. It was almost like poking you. They wanted to poke a bear. They wanted to make you mad. Whoever this group is, or per they wanted to deliberately make you mad. They wanted to make you upset. These people don't love themselves nor like themselves. Like, not at all. These people have way too much time on their hands. They think about you a lot as well. And secret with this high priest is, with the justice and the magician coming, these people think of, like, ways to try to block you, stop you. And they try to use people who are, like, close. Like, this is someone who could have, like, sent a lot. Like, it's weird. Like, this is crazy. Like, could be a Pisces. A Libra with the magician and the justice with um, clarifying the high priestess. It's like these people wanted you to receive like some sort of like your light is really bothering whoever these people are. Your like your glow up, and this could be a thing where it's like someone from this group possibly like dated you or tried to get in your way before, and then they recruited recruited these like people or these friends. But again, these friends are only cool or they only talk when you're brought up. Other than that, these people don't have nothing to talk to each other about. It's very weird. But it's about your light, your attractiveness, especially with the Queen of Wands and the King of Wands with the Emperor that was in the beginning. And again, you don't even have to be a fire sign, but it's something about your glow up, your elevation, especially with this Emperor card. That's the only Emperor. The Empress didn't even come out. You are this Emperor. And then for me, the energy says it kind of all. With the King and Queen of Wands, I didn't even look at that as like um, third party energy. It was just more so like these people are looking in for attractiveness, the attention that you're stealing. They feel like you're gaining and getting too much power, especially if you told like these people off or you defended yourself. Like these people feel like, oh my, like how dare you almost defend yourself? How dare you stick up to yourself? How dare you tell me off? What's the seven of wands? What's the seven of wands? You got the devil for the seven of wands. Could you even be a Capricorn with the three of cups? These people are obsessed with you. You like your energy bringing you down as well. Literally with the chariot, you definitely could have moved away from these people. I would definitely not reconcile with these people because they honestly resonate with the past person of you. And I feel like that's, especially if like someone's constantly coming for you or they was like in the past, it's almost because this person, again, they resonate with the past version of you. These people can't stand to see you elevate, change. It's almost like unbelievable because they don't want to do it. They can't do it. It's more so they don't want to do it. It's about the work that these people don't want to put in, implement into their own lives. They're okay with living some sort of lifestyle that they know is clearly not getting them anywhere. 
but they're okay with living, I don't know, living that way. Again, it could be three, a group of three people. Cancer could even be evolved. And if not, you definitely moved away from these people. You even could have moved on from this situation as a whole. What's this moon card? Wow, you got the lovers coming out in reverse. What's the moon with the lovers in reverse? What's the moon with the lovers in reverse? What's the moon with the lovers in reverse? You got the king of pentacles. Yeah, these, this is, oh my goodness. Like these, someone just wanted like money as well with the four sword. Oh my goodness. What's this lovers in reverse? You got Gemini energy out here, I didn't see it already. Capricorn Taurus Virgo. Yeah, you got the Seven of Cups. Why with the Queen of Cups? Yeah, somebody wanted to cast some sort of illusion about a water sign, an earth sign. But I don't... What's this lovers in reverse? Somebody could be saying they don't love like a, a, cap, a earth sign or a water sign. Yeah, with the tower, I feel like somebody's feelings is about to get exposed. Like somebody could be telling like, especially if it's like a ringleader in a certain situation. Cause somebody's hiding some sort of emotion. Cause with the moon, the lovers in reverse clarified the moon, then the king of pentacles, seven of cups with the queen of cups, the tower. Someone was lying and saying that they didn't have emotion for another person. Again, an earth sign or a water sign is saying this. Somebody wanted to cast some sort of illusion, especially if someone was like picking on you. They were picking on you because they liked you. They wanted to sleep with you. Like it's somebody's not as slick as they really think they are with the Queen of Swords. Somebody is not as smart as they really think as they think that they are with the Wheel of Fortune. Because somebody is like catching on or questioning someone. Like, why are you doing something? Why did you do something in the first place? Even if you like dated, even if you dated someone and if, the, if this is, you know, resonating for you and they have other friends, there was like a ringleader that was like persuading because that's not even like, Michael, I mean, only take it if it resonates there could have been someone you were interested in and they had a friend or y'all had a mutual friend and this mutual friend was like getting involved or anytime you and this friend would have like conflict this person would call up the person you were like interested in this person is like starting to question like what what is going on like why, why do you constantly call me what what is there even the problem between the two of y'all why did you even bring a certain piece of drama or information to me anyways like what's going on it's because this friend this other person likes you or they just they, they are attracted to you and it's something about your life they don't want to be it's very weird with the two of wands with the two of cups somebody knows they have feelings for you with the four of wands as well is someone in the in this group that that wants to be like a bully that wants to like torment you they actually have feelings for you they actually like you mm -hmm. and they don't like the fact that they don't like you I mean, they don't like the fact that they like you. See, it's trippy. <laughs> like someone's really lying about their feelings. Like they're cost, they're casting like facades with that seven of cups. What's the seven of cups with the queen of cups? I'm sorry, I hope it's so just, what the hang man? Could be a Pisces. Someone is lying about how they really feel about like their friend's partner or someone their friend used to mess with or who they're bullying. Like, I'm going to be completely honest with you. It definitely does seem like someone is targeting another person because of, like, their success, how much praise they get, how much attention they get, their light, their healing energy. Because it's a thing where it's like you could be uplifting people and people, like, in your community, certain people that didn't heal or that don't know how to, they want to target you because, like, you're, you're helping... You, those around you, like, heal as well. You're sending positive vibes around. It's something about you just being positive. And like uplifting that's like irritating a certain group of individuals with the Ten of Pentacles. What's this King of Wands? Again, and it could be a Pisces. 
Yeah, with the strength and the star. These are people who wanted to hold back like your light. Because with the king, the king of wands, you, you could be a, a Leo Aries Sagittarius, but this is something about your attractiveness, your 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 glow up. With the strength and the star, these are people who wanted like to like hold you back, your potential back. Especially if you're dealing with like a runner and a chaser dynamic at one point in time. This per whoever the runner was, especially if it wasn't you. This person wanted to keep running from you so that way you wouldn't see your potential and grow. Like this person already knew you, like these people know you were attractive way before you even really knew that you were. Like someone, people knew your potential way before you did. And these people wanted to stop it. They wanted to block it. And by way of doing that was just like playing games with you, making you run around, chase them. It was basically to waste time for you to not be focused on the things that are like most important. And these people see that you are not staying unfocused anymore you're actually quite focused now on the things that you want to do the things that you want to um like partake in like different hobbies different job like different avenues for yourself these people even see you especially if you are like some sort of like creator that was one of the main things these people wanted to like stop or block it was something about your creativity as well they feel like you're very imaginative you have a big brain a big mind like a mega mind um these people think you were you're, you were able to kind of like cultivate and bring anything into like fruition especially when it comes to like a um like a deal some sort of like um project like these people feel like you are someone who people would love to have on your team as far as like sharing ideas um moving things along investing like but these people want to be seen that way but they don't they, these people really don't do that like if you were to ask these people for help they wouldn't even help you they don't even help each other they don't even like you like these people don't even really like each other again if there's this disdain like dislike for you that brought them together with the Nine of Cups, selfishly. With the Princess of Cups. What's the Fool card? You got the Justice card coming out with the Three of Swords. These people see that something they were doing that just was not working. Like you still was able to move forward with this Fool happily to with this justice and the three of swords. These people are really hurt by this as well. Like, these people are really hurt that you're like, you're confident as well in yourself with the high priestess. And it's something, especially if you are like a tarot leader, a high, a high priestess, a high priest. These people thought like, something that they were doing was in the dark. These people really thought with the two of cups high priestess that they were meeting up in the dark. They were seeing each other like in the dark. I don't know, I don't know. It's very weird with the will of fortune and it was to plan something. They wanted to hurt you. Whether it was like through people, through friendships, through lovers, like the three of pentacles. I can't get away with that. There was definitely a group. And you were definitely being talked about, like heavily. What's this three of pentacles? You got the eight of pentacles coming out. Wow, with the eight of wands. 88 could be significant as well. Eight. It's something about your work and how fast it takes off with the three of pentacles. And it's almost like these people, well, because <laughs> with this three of pentacles, you got the eight of pentacles with the eight of wands. And then on this deck, you got the eight of pentacles, um, the three of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So yeah, it's something about like your work. And it's a thing where it's like these people see that you don't need other people around you to kind of help. Like even if you are in a situation where there's a group setting and you do have to implement some sort of work as a, as a group, um, that's fine. But these people do feel like something takes off for you even alone. Like you actually don't need anyone's assistance technically. Like these people see you as someone who can do it. You are gifted with the ability of doing a lot of things on your own. People don't have to help you, aid you, assist you. Again, it's nice that they do, but these people see that you kind of, you, you have a light. You are very blessed. You are very gifted with whatever you are doing. You are able to attract and it's something that they are really not able to do at least not on their own what's this double card you got the princess of swords and you got the king of cups at the bottom what's this double card princess of swords 
You have the two of Pentacles. Yeah, these are people that wanted you to like be very, very, very reactive to like their um their toxic like wings. These people was like argumentative. They wanted you to argue. They wanted to fight with the Seven of Pentacles. These people were really trying to pick with you to like fight them. With the King of Wands in reverse, could definitely be a fire sign. A moon, uh, a moon, the moon could be a Cancer Pisces, heavy Leo as well with the sun right after that. These are people who are very irate. Like they're just, blah, like I don't, mm. and these people again with the seven of pen, they were like implementing different things to like make you, to piss you off. Like, I don't even know. Like these people just wanted to really pull at you and they just wanted, they want, these people wanted to know you badly. Like whoever this, this is, whoever these people are, they wanted to be in your energy badly and they didn't care how they was like going to do it. One person likes you. And it's not somebody that you've been with. I want to make that very clear because somebody's like really pump faking and I can't, especially with that lovers coming out in reverse because I can literally, not here because I don't want to, whatever, but it's almost like a conversation two people are having and it's almost like someone is calling almost like you out your name. They're saying like you're possibly, mm, mm, like you're broke, you're dirty, you're like a bunt, like, but it's almost like this person has no, like how, where, where is this coming from? How do you even, how do you even know this? But like, and this person makes it seem like they don't like you for whatever reason. Like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Because it's dead. What's this um, tower? Or one key player is about to like expose themselves. Like you're about to know who a ringleader is like who someone was following why it was hard for you to get to know someone like where where's some sort of drama where was the drama starting where was you're about to know you're about to find out with the five of cups with the seven of swords like i think a lot is about to be shown to you yeah with the nine of wands because i feel like you're ready to handle something especially if you still had questions you didn't know where who team someone was like on like that. Mm -hmm. so I'm hoping this is resonating for who it needs to resonate for. Because I do feel like this is bullying at someone's grown age. And it's weird with the Ten of Pentacles. It could, it could be a family member as well. Or it's about like a generational wealth. Like these people wanted to distract you from like finding love, finding happiness. They didn't want that for you. They didn't want you to have it. What's this tower with the five of cups? You got a three of pentacles coming out. Whatever. Yeah, some sort of group is being dismantled because you're seeing something and they see that you see something with the Prince of Wands. These people feel like you're catching on to something as well. Like who's saying what, who's doing what, who's involved. I think that's more important. What's the three of pentacles in reverse? You got the Empress in reverse. Jeez. With the Prince of Pentacles in reverse. Could be a Taurus, a Libra. Yeah, these people could have. Mm, mm. mm. Cards about to fall all out in here. Or, yeah, especially if you're like a woman. This could be somebody that was just literally trying to undermine you. They, they, they were very jealous of the things that you had, your possessions, especially if it came like to a. a like, especially, this is definitely like a frenemy. This was someone who was talking amongst you behind like your back. But the five of wands that was on the floor, I'm not going to take it. But in a nine of swords, like this was someone who was like really competing with you kind of behind your back. Like you possibly didn't even notice. Um, and this person was like getting other people involved, um, especially once they were getting like caught up for a different thing. Like this person didn't want to stand alone, especially not against you. This is somebody who was very intimidated by you. Um, and I don't even want you to second guess that. I don't care how big this person is, how many people are coming up against you with them. Like whoever these groups of people are, they're afraid of you. They're very intimidated by your light, which is why they all come up as one together against possibly one person. But yeah, especially if you are a woman, there's a ringleader who is a woman who is very jealous of you. And if y'all aren't women, this man is very feminine. Um, especially if you are, you are gay. Um, this is a very feminine man, very needy, codependent, um, no matter the gender with this empress in reverse. This is somebody who looks out for the cookout. Um, and I, I, I honestly don't even mean that in the best way. This is somebody who will throw you under the bus to save themselves. This is somebody who will scam you if they are low. Family, friend, or foe. 
Like these are these are people who will backstab each other, throw each other under the bus for some sort of gain. And they so they were kind of trying to like do this is almost like a real life sacrifice. Like these people it feels like it was more than one person. But someone like pretending like they didn't like you or like they didn't want nothing like do with you or they didn't like know you, that's a lie. Like somebody's really jealous of another person, they keep it really hidden. And they're actually like secret. Because this is somebody who like loves to hate, like this is somebody who wishes they can embody you in like the sweetest way with the hierophant. This is somebody who sees that you do have some sort of like light to you. You're very blessed, almost like ordained. And this person almost does wish that it was them. Like this person wanted to bring you down with the high priestess. Could definitely be a Pisces. You're very blessed. And I feel like this person is seeing this. But yo, especially with this high priestess, Hierophant, I cannot get away from the Hierophant card. Hallelujah. Because uh, this person feels like you are very blessed, very protected by God, your intuition. This person feels, especially if you are a reader, you don't have to be. You could, of course, listen to him. But you have inclinations of your own. Um, You're not dumb. I think that's more so. You listen to just your better judgment, your gut. Not everybody has to be a tarot reader or intuitive to feel like, you know, they're doing things correctly or they're listening or they're obeying by their God, or, you know, the Allah, whoever you believe in. But this person feels like, boy, oh boy, they should not have done, got involved, said anything kind of like about you. But they feel like, wow, I didn't know this person was going to kind of like show up and show out the way that they did. Because this, of course, is someone, this could have been happening for a while, a while. And you could not have really known like who was involved, who who was really looking out for you, who really was not. Because I feel like there was a lot of situations where there could have been people really in your face acting like they were like helping or concerned or like, what's going on? Or They were like running back to this group of friends or this community and talking about it, talking about your information, your business. Like these are people who wanted to, oh, why did you move? Well, you know, what happened? Or, you know, what happened to your car? And, and so they can go and talk. They wanted to just have information on you. Like, it's weird. These people just wanted to pocket it to talk, to bring it up whenever they wanted to, they, especially your failures. It was something about your failures that these people love to hear about. Love to hear about. Especially if you had like, a, again, a friend and a lover that knew each other, they were a part of like the same community to bring you down. I don't think that these people did anything, but these people definitely didn't have the, the best intentions for you. And it doesn't have to be a thing either, but it definitely just feels that way. Or like a coworker, like these people know you some way, somehow. Like it clearly is just not out of thin air, but you do have to take this how it resonates. But somebody is very codependent and very jealous of you and what you embody as a woman or a man. Like this person is very, very upset that you were able to pick yourself back up. Like they thought, because this is somebody who cannot do it. Like if, the, if this person was being antagonized and targeted the way that you were, or even talked about and gossiped about, because there could have been a thing where you could have felt like just this negative, energy on you and it's because these people were bad mouthing you honestly for no reason and you were feeling it and they were doing it so much they wanted to is it a regular like these people wanted to like conjure up some sort of spirit through, through mouth through their speech and they were hoping that it was going to like attach to you or that eventually you were going to believe it like it's it's crazy it's crazy but this empress in reverse deadly jealous of you that what This is Empress in reverse with the High Priestess. Again, you got Taurus, Libra, Energy, Pisces. Yeah, you got the Six of Pentacles with the Sun. These people see you are you are still giving you are, you are still being given to. You are still happy. They were not able to like steal your joy, take your energy either. With the Hierophant still, you are protected. With the Hierophant still at the bottom. What's this Empress in reverse? I want one just for this. Yeah, you got the fool, the prince of wands with the four. This person is now getting rejected. Something this person is doing is, is no longer like valid. People are not paying attention. People are getting fed up, bored with this person. Bored with like kind of tart, like something's getting old. Especially with you like moving on, you're, you're worried about your own, like you're, you're not really worried about this person anymore. You possibly aren't even really around these people as much anymore. And someone still wants like a problem with you or they still would want to talk about you from time to time. These people are disinterested. What's this fool? This person feels like they cannot, yeah, move on the way that you can. Do things the way that you can with the eight of cups. Like, this person feels like they can't. 
leave people alone. They can't just like this. Is somebody who's like very codependent. They they like to linger and hang on to like bad situations, good situations. Like this is someone who cannot end cycles. They can't. People have to walk away from them. Like be done with them. This is somebody who will deliberately hold on with all their might. And they will try to manipulate you or begot, like confuse you to stay in some sort of weird dynamic with them. What's this for a cut? With the Prince of Swords? Yeah, and this person sees that some sort of, again, some sort of action behavior with this Prince of Swords isn't working. Because with, with the Prince of Swords, that's not even giving me any type of action. It's giving me some sort of behavior. With the King of Wands at the bottom, very ruthless. Yeah, with the moon. Very promiscuous as well. This Cancer Pisces, Leo Aries Sag. Oh, excuse me. Gassy. Uh, <laughs> with the Nine of Swords. It's something this person was saying. With the Ace of Cups. Something they did did not mean. A group of people. Like, whatever people or a person was saying about you, none of them believe it. None of them believe that it's true. Other people don't believe it's true. Like, something's getting old. And actually, people are afraid of something coming out as well. They're afraid of being seen or looked at a certain way. Especially because you're coming, especially if you are starting to get like evidence or you know who different people in a situation is, they're terrified of that. They're terrified of getting exposed of people like really seeing them for their nasty like character or their behavior, especially at somebody's big ass age. Like these people can even be older than you in some way, shape or form. You got the six of swords, yeah, and the prince of cups. These people see you moving forward. But what's, this, what's the prince of cups? With the Queen of Wands at the bottom. What's, this, what's the Six of Swords with the Prince of Cups? You got the Nine of Cups coming out. Wow, with the Nine of Pentacles. 99, can you even be see? Oh, wow. And these are exactly why these people are upset. These people wanted to take a lot of just, like, your happiness. These people just wanted to, like, get in your way. Y'all, I don't even, oh, my goodness, because I'm not a mind reader. Uh, I'm really not. And these people thought, like, in some way, shape, or form. Like, that they were once getting in your way. Like, these people really did think that they were, like, doing something to you or getting in, like, your way or something. Especially if someone like me, it seemed like they didn't, like something was all a lie, a facade. Something is not real at all. And it's honestly the way you even perceive yourself. Because some sort of illusion was casted to where like something is about to break. Because something you were like being told or something you were hearing, the way people were treating you, it will only come from this group, this, this, this family, whatever this is, something is not real. And it's the way these people wanted you to see yourself. These people don't even see you like that. They wanted you to think that they seen you in a certain light that they really don't even see you. These people actually are very, you're very admired by these, by these people. They love some sort of work that you actually do as well. These people wish that they could do a lot of things that you're doing. Wow, some sort of illusion is about to be really dismantled. And it's how you kind of see envision like yourself because something is really not real i don't even think you you understand how powerful like your aura your voice your energy really is like i don't even think you really realize how much of like almost like a character you are to people not like a character meaning like you're fake or anything of like in a negative term but almost like a character meaning like people actually really do like you and I think there's a thing where you could have got sucked in, warped into some sort of like illusion where you started to feel otherwise. Isn't this because of these, that was these people's plans. These people wanted you to feel weird or n neglected, rejected, but it was an illusion and it was casted by these. These are the only people that would do that to you. Because other people outside of this group, this family, people actually really like and adore you, which is why these people acted the way they acted and targeted you the way they targeted you. With the Queen of Wands, very attractive, if not a fire sign with the Four of Pentacles. These people feel like you have such an inner beauty. And then when I open it, you got the King of Swords with the beauty and brains. These people really feel like you have. And other people, these people know that you're looked at as like very highly as well. 
Yeah, something was like off of a facade, and the moment you find out like different key people in this in a situation, even if you, you even if you do already, that's even better because I feel like some the moment you start to really pinpoint who everybody is, these people are going to feel exposed to where they're going to stop. And I don't even not this. I don't. These people are going to feel exposed. There's something about them feeling exposed. What's this love in reverse? <laughs> I could not get away from this. Line. Sorry about that. You have the seven of swords. This is somebody who's lying about how they truly feel about you. This person like loves you, loves your work, loves who you are as an individual. Like these are people who really wish that they can embody you. Like these are people who don't even really hate you. They want you to think that you don't even really you have haters, but in a way where they hate you because they admire you so much, they like you so much. Like this isn't even really hate with the five of swords. These people want to like deceive you and be mean to you because they they like you that much. Like these people, it's so backwards though. Because I know some of y'all gonna probably be like, "What the? What is he even talking about?" But the image. Mm. Now I ain't saying that he was good. Because I could even say that like these people are just they are they're enamored by like the person that you are. I think that's more so what it is. Again, these people wish that they embody something that you have. Even if you're a woman and these were men and vice versa, even if you were um, a man and these were women, or it was a mixture of whomever, however you were targeted, these people are actually admired by you. They really are your worth ethic, especially when you get knocked down. These people seeing you get knocked down and pick yourself back up with the five of swords. Multiple times, I feel like. Literally, with the king of swords, five of, like these are people who strategize different things to like deceive you and you still got back up. You still picked yourself back up with the hermit. Even if you shied away from it for a little bit, these people feel like you came back 10 times harder, 10 times stronger. You gotta find that toy right now. I'm at the end of it. With the temperance, these people see that you are finding peace with the princess of cups at the bottom. Could you even be a Sagittarius? That's your card. And that you're healing from all of this with the five of wands. What's the seven of swords temperance with the five of wands? You have the devil. These are people who are not at peace with themselves and they didn't want you to be at peace either. And that's exactly how I'm gonna close it. You got devil, um, devil Capricorn energy out here, y'all. Um, remain sane, I honestly wanna say, because there is a thing where like these people wanted to play with like someone's mind. Um, again, some sort of illusion is really about to fall to the wayside, especially about how you feel about yourself. Um, I'm going to be completely honest with you. Whether you feel this way or not, a lot of people actually secretly do like find you very attractive. They feel like you are becoming more and more beautiful, more and more handsome like every day. It's something about your attractiveness. Um, it's very shallow to me in a way because um, I do feel like that's one of the main reasons why you were so targeted the way you are. You're likable. Um, very charismatic. These people feel like almost like, yes, you could be on TV. You could want to aspire to be an actor, but these people feel like you actually, if you wanted to do that, you these, you could be. You could be in the forefront for a, a music video, um, a, a dance segment, like in a, a, a movie scene. Like these people just feel like you have different avenues that you could jump into, and they don't really feel like they have those avenues for themselves. So yeah, y'all, I'm in there. I definitely do hope the messages resonate with y'all and I definitely do hope the messages were useful. Um, and until next time, guys.